love helping out our frangelistas with tips on how to do difficult things. We call this segment Frangela's How To. Today's edition of Frangela's How To is called How to Break Up with Someone Like an Adult. Ooh. It's a difficult one, but with the help of these tips from Cosmopolitan Magazine, with our Frangela spin, we know that you'll soon be able to break up with sensitivity and compassion and quickly so you can go to lunch. Here we go. Mm. Sensitive setting. Yes. <laughs> it says, I care about your feelings. Yes. Tip one, be clear, have convi conviction. In your decision, be clear when you break up. That's right. Don't do this. So I was thinking maybe we could like take like a break. I want to take a break. But you know what I mean, like where we like we go our separate ways, and maybe well, see, we're in not. In fact, I want to be closer to you. Well, I was thinking that maybe we could be less close. I want to like... be so close to you, I wear your skin as a suit. <laughs> where, where's my cat? Meow. See how that didn't work? No, no, no. Instead, do this. This relationship is over. I think there's a distinct possibility that you're a sociopath. Mm. And so I've decided to stop seeing you for my safety and the safety of my pets. Mm. <laughs> like an adult. Yes. That's how you do That's it, people. How you do that. That's how you do that. You're free. Yes. Tip number two, you've got to fall out of love in your mind first, people. Mm. Don't sit there and be re remembering all the good times. Right. You've got to remember the negative times that brought you to this breakup bench, mm. okay? Like, don't do this. Oh, I'm thinking about when we went on that wonderful vacation. Yeah, yeah. You, you beautiful. took me to France. Yes, it was like, it was. we sat on a park bench just like this, and it was beautiful. It was. <laughs> I wasn't thinking about dumping you then the way I am now. Oh, oh see how that doesn't, right. help? that doesn't help? That doesn't help. What you have to do is work. remember why you're there. Mm. Is there a reason why my car is smashed? <laughs> oh, because I did that. <laughs> Why I did I, I didn't even car. ask to borrow my car. Well, because I don't, I don't respect your boundaries. See what I mean? <laughs> See how this leads to breaking up? It's over. <laughs> Tip three, be kind but strict. Be respectful but have boundaries. Don't do this. Listen, uh, I don't want to bump with you anymore, uh, but you know what? Here's the deal. Uh, I can still talk to you. I want to call you and, and tell you about my problems. No, that doesn't seem fair. And I want you to fair. come to all my family that events. That doesn't seem fair and, to me. And um, I want to lean on you as a crutch uh, in my life. I don't understand that, but you're dumping me? But I'm dumping but you. But it sounds like you want to still use me for things, but you're dumping me. Exactly. <laughs> That's not how adults do things. Yes. What you should do is this. I am taking all of my things and going away from you. That's, wow. That's a boundary. I got that boundary. That's, <laughs> that's, that's like the great wall of boundaries yeah. right there. Tip number four, figure out, ask yourself, how valuable is this relationship? Mm. And that'll help you decide how you break up. Say, is this breakup worth a dinner, mm. which could cost money? Or maybe just a few minutes on a park bench like this. Mm -hmm. Only you can decide. I was making a pro and con list of things about you that I like and don't, right. which is why I'm going to text you this breakup. That, I feel, that feels weird. <laughs> and yet, appropriate, because that's how much I care. Yes! <laughs> Meet time with Frangela. 